Hi everyone. So I was pulling cards to see a small message for the month of February and normally I pull cards and post the card and give a write up regarding the message that is coming for all of the month of February as a very small gist which will be applicable for all of us as collectives. But uh, they gave me these two cards as the main energy vibration for all of the month of February which is going to be applicable for everybody and uh, the kind of intuitive guidance that I got through these cards was that I have to make a recorded message again. So the message over here if you can see in the cards closely we have the first card as the Queen of Swords. The Queen of Swords is a queen definitely so she is a person holding a command and here you can see that the sword is um, in a position that you know she is ready to fight herself back from anybody and what I can see in the clouds is a face over here very evident and the second card that they gave to me is the two of swords. So what I believe that in this month, all of us are going to be in the energy of this Queen of Swords, who is going to look for some kind of a clarity in any situation where we are going to make decisions. This Queen of Swords is going to listen to the angelic realm, to the guides, to the gut feelings, see what she is doing in order to make the decisions. She is closing her eyes, she is sitting in isolation under the moon's energy, trying to protect herself with her swords, not getting affected by the outside world, protecting and shielding her energy and listening to the inner voice of the guides here up in the skies. So this is a very, very deep message and definitely it needed a voice behind to let you all know what they are trying to say so what the message is saying for you first thing i would say that the energies for this month are calling you to listen more than speak listen more than speak listen to your inner voice your guides are wishing to talk to you your guides are wishing to connect with you your guides really want to give you intuitive guidance, intuitive information. Sit for meditations, dear friends. Listen to the wisdom of your own body. There will be decisions which will be needed for you to be made in this month. Definitely, the Swords energy always talks about the energy of clarity of mind. It talks about the energy of mind. So this is a month where you are being guided to take all your decisions with the help of your mind and your intuition. So your third eye chakra needs to be cleansed and activated and from there you are going to have clear decision making power. Now since she is a queen which tells me it really doesn't matter if you are a male or a female you are in a position of power. You are queen, you have an authority in your hand and you will be the person who will be asked to take the final decision to give the final words on a certain situation where uh, the you know final answer, justice, truth is needed. So this is not a month like the last month. Uh, 2024, I've seen the energies are extremely dif different, extremely different. And uh, this, this month is the month of Aquarius, which is the month of the air signs and rightly the energy of the Queen of Swords and the Two of Swords is the energy of the air signs. This is the energy of a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius person and all of us are going to sense this energy, which is the mental energy, the mental energy. But however, I see that, you know, the clouds do represent some kind of haziness, some kind of confusion. But in all of this confusion, I see the Queen of Swords sitting with herself and, you know, I mean, she's in her thoughts. This is like kind of, you know, connecting with yourself, sitting alone 
with her sword she is cutting her cords with those situations that cause chaos and then listening to this voice can you see this image over here here this one in the cart this is the voice of your guides your angels your ascended masters your deceased loved ones in heaven and she is hearing it so this is a month to spend time alone and then make all of the decisions this is the main energy of this month at this point you could be thinking that you know this does not resonate with me very soon it's just the 1st of february very soon you will see that yes what she was talking made a lot of sense and when all of it makes sense to you do comment down below dear friends sending you lots of love and letting you know as it's, it's a month of empowerment because we have a queen sitting over here there are decisions to be made there is truth to be revealed and she's very sharp with her communication so this is a month of communications this is a month of good mental clarity a uh, good intuition okay so you're in a position of power this is a month of you know mercury being activated your mind your speech but that's coming from the place of your inner voice yes so that's the message i want to give to everybody for the you know this is the energy of this month strangely enough you could say that you know this was a month of love this was a month of a lot many things there could be decisions with regard to love or relationships there could be decisions with regard to a lot many things i see that the decisions are uh, you know due but you are not hasty hasty you are taking your time you are sitting with yourself i mean here also if you see you are protecting your energy you 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 want to take your time you want to listen to your intuition you want to sit with yourself and then weigh your options carefully and then make the uh, you know decisions in whichever area of your life with the queen of swords and the two of swords the court of law is going to be very significant so uh, for the lawyers for the judges for the people fighting the court case this month is going to be very significant for any kind of work with regard to the court of law paperwork any kind of a commitment you know new jobs new offers marriage commitments movement any kind of a paperwork that could be a commitment reports from the doctors what to do with regard to any kind of you know paperwork you would be listening to your intuition that is where you are going to get your answers from and listening to the guides like us tarot card readers or anybody could also be like listening to your intuition is like you know god can use anybody as a channel it could be me it could be other card readers it could be some lyrics of the music that you're listening over here this person is closing their eyes is sitting in isolation just listening to something sometimes it's that you know the music had some lyrics which were the answer to your questions or just your mind uh, you know starts to speak with you some you know something you're seeing as a clear voice in your third eye that is your answer or you hear as a clear clear audience all of this month your clear audience clear voice clear sentient abilities are going to grow and again i would say your communications and your thinking i also believe that you're going to give up your negative thinking patterns the old patterns you're going to break free from them and with the swords energy over here yes you've got to keep cutting your cords from people places and situations to protect yourself anything that is negative for your energy you're going to cut that off and you want to spend time in isolation with yourself we you see the energy of isolation over here from from this place you are becoming strong so this is the message dear friends now sending you lots of love and wishing best of the best for the month of february for all of my friends here on hexos lots of love